Hey, thanks again for joining me here for the EMS Success Formula. Listen, guys, there's a lot of content in this area, and I thought the best way to get you started and so you can get the most out of it in the fastest time possible, we need to break down some of these sections, explain to you what each one is about, and how you can really get the most out of it. So I'm going to break away from my face, get on my computer, and show you how to do that. So let's go ahead and take a look. Okay, so... Welcome again to the EMS exam formula course and this is the member dashboard and I want to just kind of give you a quick overview so you can get the most out of your time without jumping all over the place and this is the dashboard like I said and you can get to this when you're logged in by either going to this link here which will take you to this page under exam coaching group or under exam success you will see the exam success course here as well and as an exam member you can also access this all this content these exams here you can go to the exam directly using any of these links here as well so just something to keep in mind there okay now when you get in and you first start my suggestion to you is to use these two videos first they will go ahead and help you get the most out of this course the fastest because what will happen is most people when they look at these two videos alone it brings so much clarity and focus into what people should be doing that it answers a lot of their questions right off the bat okay when it comes to either taking the exams using the insight EMS exams video or the quick start video here of using practice exams is really going to help you focus when it comes to using practice exams so you get the most out of it, not just in understanding how to take the test, but also how to use the test so that you're actually learning when you're doing it and not just memorizing. Okay. Now, once you watch these videos, you do, you do what they say and kind of get a little overview there. Then you're going to want to look at the exam success formula video. Now, this is the actual meat and potatoes, guys, of this course. And this is going to give you the key elements of making the most of your study time. And it's going to help you figure out how to apply my system, my course, okay, to your particular study style. So it's not one size fits all, right? There are key elements you need to keep in place, but you want to fit it to your study style so that it works for you. Okay, it's not going to work for me. I want it to work for you, right? I have a different way of studying and than you may have. So I want you to go ahead and use it as the best way for you to go ahead and study and use the formula. Now, of course, we have both practice exams, EMT and paramedic level, depending upon what you're struggling with. Let me just give you a quick um, uh, view here, the EMT exam. Just want to mention something. So you've got all of your exams here, all right? There are eight exams in total in the EMT level, but you also have the NRE SIM level exams too. Now these are a different, I'm gonna click on this just to kind of bring us to that page I want you to see. Inside the NRE SIM EMT exams, you have another five exams here. And these are sort of a, another software platform, web-based platform that you'll be taking. And these will go ahead and be presented randomly. But these exams are designed to turn off when you've reached a passing or failing threshold, much like the actual National Registry exam. Okay, so... You take them, you never know when it's going to turn off. And I want, I did this so that you kind of get a feel for what to expect. Okay, so kind of maybe eliminate that stress a little bit as well. All right, so that's a different section when it comes to that. All right, so again, you get those eight exams and then you get these five as well. Okay, so I'm going to go back to the dashboard. And when you get back to the dashboard again, you've got a couple more videos I want to point out to you and these here are thinking ahead and the EMS mind map. The mind map can really also help you zero in on what works best for you when you're studying. Okay if you're having more struggles with that and you're still struggling with even answering questions these two videos can really help you kind of really go further into it. All right so check these out if you're still struggling or you want some additional keys when taking 
your exams. In addition to that, we have the understanding the NREMT. This is a real deep dive guide. This is a four part video series, okay, where you've got, I broke them down into 30 minute segments for easier uh, viewing. But what happens is you can go ahead and you can actually, I'm going to click on this here because I want to want to go ahead and just kind of bring the, just kind of show you Headache. how it brings in here. And we know that and there okay, is. Lower that so we're not listening to two voices at once. But it kind of goes over the questions and how to break it down and things like that. Um, and again, this is a four-part series that is inside there. It's broken down to 30-minute segments for easier viewing. And then just real quick to bring it into kind of round it out for you. You've got two documents to download. One is the tips understanding the passing the NREMT and that's under the mind map video. You'll find a download link link there for that. And your quick study guide is in the exam formula. When you go to the exam formula, you'll see a download there for the quick study guide as well to help you uh, implement the formula itself. Okay. Um, and finally, guys, don't forget, we've got the bonuses. Don't forget to download all the bonuses. All right, you got about $100 worth of bonuses there waiting for you. And sign up for the live coaching. Live coaching is every Thursday at 1 p.m. And we those coaching sessions last between 30 minutes, 45 minutes, depending upon what is going on and how many members join for the live coaching. Okay, so uh, all lots of stuff to get through, guys. Okay, and this is why I made this video because I don't want to overwhelm you too much. So that's why I want you to go ahead, start with these two videos. Okay, by the time you watch these two videos, you take a couple of practice exams. It'll be time for the live coaching, and I can answer questions to help guide you a little bit more and keep you on track and get you into the formula and developing it for yourself so that you have a bigger success when you're taking exams and of course guys don't forget this whole program is also designed to build your knowledge base and make you a better EMS provider so it's not just about taking the exams while this will help you throughout your EMS career it's also designed to build your knowledge base so yes it'll help you build confidence throughout your EMS career when it comes to taking exams, no matter what exam it is, because you can use the formula once you set it up and know it for yourself, right? So there's some work involved here, but once you get it down and you have it set for you, that's it. You're done. You can use the same formula, the same techniques every time you go to take an exam, and you will find that your stress level and confidence is much lower and your confidence is much, much higher. Okay, but again, it's not just for the test, it's also going to help you build your confidence. You will find when you do something as simple as using this video here and using practice exams, you follow the tips just in this video alone, you will find that you're going to be building your knowledge base and not just memorizing things just to get through and pass an exam. Okay, all right, guys, that's it. Um, again, you have access to me with this content, so be sure to join me in the coaching. To access, access that, that me there and get questions answered, and you can always go ahead and comment here as well, and, I, and I'll get the comments from you and respond right here in the members area. All right, guys, I'll see you on the next coaching, and uh, again, send me any questions via email as well, and I'll see you in uh, next Thursday. All right, stay safe.